It's your boy D-Flo, and we back with season two of Tri Love. You know too much. I'm not I feel like you're doing too much, to be honest. I feel like I'm not doing enough. You know what I'm saying? But you do need to check the timeline. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the season two of Tri Love. I'm so, I still can't believe what happened this season. Finally come back with the results. What's that? Tune in and let's get to it. So Jan's moved in. Um, you know, it's, we've been we've been knowing Jan's for a minute now, as y'all know. So we felt like we're in official relationship now. We're in this triad, and we're like, you know what? We feel like you should live here, why not? You know, you're so far away, whenever we want to see you, whenever we want to chill, you got to fly out. So we told her like, why don't you just move in? You can stay in our room, we got extra closet space, we got everything you need, just come live with us. Come on now, hold your head still. Why are you moving so much? Come on now. I know you're gonna mess it up. Yeah, because you're moving. Every time that like Leia braids my hair, she messes my part up. Every time. We gotta get Soraya or our daughter or somebody to, to make sure the part is right. She's always messing up my hair. I think I should pay somebody else to do it. Y'all think I should? I think I should. It's time to just cut this at this point. Your hair longer than my week. We just cut it like, like two weeks yeah, ago. Yeah, and, and it grew like three inches since yesterday. No, it didn't. There's no way. Maybe it did. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking about cutting it. Real, like real short. Going back to the old deep flow. I'm gonna get a fade. Yeah, a low boy. All right, y'all. So this is actually really exciting. I'm happy that like Yans is here because so much has changed as far as like our household dynamic. Like she's added in so much to the household. She's been a lot of help. Even when it comes to things that I didn't even realize like I needed help with, like flow braids, my girls, like my girls love her. Let's just say that. Like they play with her just in case because I know a lot of y'all be asking like, how's y'all with the girls or what do they think about her? You know, so like she plays a huge part in this household and I, I must say that like it has been such an amazing blessing. And that's what really being poly is all about. It's not always just about sex, you know what I'm saying? Like. But yeah, y'all, we, we do that too. You know, it goes down in the bedroom or whatever the case may be. But I can honestly say that I'm thankful that she's here and I'm glad we made this decision and I don't have any regrets so far. Hey, how do you feel like it's been since Yon's moved in? I feel like it's actually been pretty good. Like we've been getting a lot of help around the house. She's been very like active and, you know, kind of just contributing to things. And I, that's what I like about it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, she been helping clean up, cook and everything. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's a lot of advantages to it. I ain't gonna lie. I told you. And we, we haven't really argued too much recently. No, not at all. We don't argue at all. I can't even think of, like, arguing at all. But, I mean, I definitely see a lot of potential. Yeah. And... We been getting real busy and stuff in the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> This shit been going crazy. Yeah, that's all you care about, child. That's not all I care about, but I do care about it, though. <laughs> Things been going good so far, you know? Like, we haven't had no issues. She just moved in real recently, but so far it's been real good. So me and Flo are really excited about this. We're just always talking about how much Yans has been, like, great help to the house. So, like, you think our supporter is going to be okay with her moving in permanently? I feel like they should. I mean, I feel like at first they didn't really know her that well, so some of the comments were kind of negative. I feel like right. now they're starting to come around and really know right. her better, and I feel like they, you they know, starting to, she's starting to grow on everybody. Yeah, because they're always like, "Where's um, where's Lily?" Yeah, and I hate that when they ask that. It's, it's so rude. But um, right. nah, I feel like now it's just, it's, they're starting to like her. So mm -hmm. I, I think. I mean, cool. what's not to like about her? Let's be real, like. Exactly. Like if you if you don't like her, you just you just hating at this point. <laughs> right. Cause they, they just they just jealous, jealous she was down. Exactly. Yeah. But it is what it is. This is what makes us happy. So. Yeah. It's not about them. Right. They ain't gotta live with us. If they got a problem, they can you know go somewhere else. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's the one and only Yans back in the building again. 
here for season two, so let's get it. How y'all doing? Yeah, looking good. Thank you. <laughs> I feel good. I'm so glad to be here. Uh, no. You finally ready? Finally. Finally. I'm happy you're here too. Yeah, I've been having fun. Is this part in the middle? Like. Beyonce comes in to help me with Flo's hair, which, oh God, cause this boy with his head, child. I feel like this boy got more hair than me, goddamn. Like, even when I got my wigs on, like, it's time to cut this hair off. But, um, yeah, so she's definitely a lot of help with that too. When I tell y'all she's lit, everything's lit, yeah. Uh, yeah, but I am here now. <laughs> but when I go back and visit my family, y'all can come with me. Right. So, I mean, we, we know most of the people you know out there. Right, we all got the same I am, the most part. Yeah. I am super excited to finally be here in Houston with my babes. Like, it's been lit. I finally moved out here from Atlanta. I've been liking the scenery, the, the living situation, everything. So it's been really good, and so far, so good. Mm-hmm. Right, and y'all pretty much have met my uh, siblings and mm -hmm. everybody. Is there any other siblings we didn't meet? Mm-mm. Not that I know of. Anybody we should be worried about? Mm-mm. That might have a problem with you being here? Not at all. Okay, now. Who would have a problem with that? <laughs> Nobody? You know. You know. Yeah. So to celebrate season two, you guys, you know we gotta take a shot, we gotta turn up. Um, everybody been trying to figure out like, do we get into a real relationship? Do we make it official? Um, right, right. Are you gonna move here? So, are we gonna show them what we got now? We can choose one of them. Didn't you already take a shot? Okay, so I'm finally here with my loves and we love being together. Like, it's been lit. I love hanging out with Princess. I love hanging out with Flo or Leia. You know, whatever whatever y'all call her, you know, I call her something different. But I just call him back. Season Time two. to take some shots. Yay, yeah, season two, we here. I'm excited. Let's get it. She want, you want a big shot? A no. double one, cause she don't ever take them all. A small one? A small one is cool. All right. Y'all know I'm just trying to get too messed up. Okay. All right, let's do it. Season two with Trilla. Cheers, we yeah. here, we in there. <laughs> Know, I'm always about celebrations and shots and a lot of y'all be talking about I be trying to get her drunk but honestly if y'all come around me and my friends like we always turn it up we always taking shots we always getting lit and that's just what it is like we just lit people so yeah if you want to come to PMP gang house that's just what you're gonna get she be capping sometimes for real what you mean? no I got I took my shot this time okay I had cap so I put it on my head oh okay <laughs> I don't know what has come over me, but I just feel like crap. You know I'm good. Mm -hmm. Well, you're down, so that's good. Yeah. You don't complain too much. Just be late. Yeah. Just be late. <laughs> like, just late. <laughs> it's messed up. Uh, and then I gotta hear about it. To tell her to hurry up. I'll be like, no, you I tell her. <laughs> just being real. Start telling y'all to hurry up. Get your sister wife. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Uh, that might make me move a little faster. <laughs> Daddy said hurry up. Okay. <laughs> Zoom. You take it too long. <laughs> we gonna get it together. Yeah. Nah, we be having a lot of fun though. I ain't gonna lie. It's always fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Any plans we got today? I don't know. Mm -hmm. But we I know one thing. We got to turn up today. Having your help with these braids sure is good, cause girl. So see, I, I mean. So I'm finishing Flo's hair. Oh, I'm trying to finish his hair. Well, we trying to finish his hair as a, you know, thruple, you know, we got the little triad going on. And Yon, she just dramatically gets up and runs to the bathroom. And I'm just like, wait, what? Yes. You good? Yeah, I'm good. What's up? I don't know. I must have ate something bad. You was throwing up? Just a little bit. I don't know what I had. What the heck? I don't know. I don't know. We all ate the same thing. I don't feel sick. You sure? No, I'm good. Mm. 
I should be alright. She didn't even take her shot. She didn't even take her shot. Like, I walk back over here, the shot's still there. I'm like, why are you capping? Like, you, you didn't take the shot? Like, who, you're wasting liquor. Like, you, you gotta buy the next bottle if you're gonna do with stuff like that. What was it that you ate? Cause we all ate the same thing and I feel fine. I don't know. You good, man? I thought we all had the same thing. You good? Yeah, I'm all right. You threw up? Just a little bit, but I just ate something probably. So much, you threw up a lot. I'll be all right. What did you eat? We all had the same thing. Yeah, we, we had the same thing. Yeah, we just had breakfast. You know? Mm. Well, hopefully in that coochie, like. What? What's going on? Hell no, what? What the fuck? Nah. Yeah, I feel better after that. Yeah? You should yeah. drink some water. Yeah. I don't know what's going on with that, but uh, it's kind of strange. Maybe you should drink some water or something. Yeah, sure. When y'all will make me a cup, please. I'm gonna go brush my teeth real quick. All right. That's all right. She didn't take a shot. I'm like, I know she didn't get sick of this. Yeah, that's weird. But she ate the same thing we ate. I don't know. So how? I don't know. Do you feel sick? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Kind of weird, right? I don't know, maybe she just got a stomach ache or something, some food. Well, whatever it is, I hope I don't get that shit. Yeah, I don't want to get sick. No, it's a way. Hey, she better not be kissing me. Too late. <laughs> okay, so uh, she didn't take her shot, y'all. She threw up. She telling me all this extra, like, yeah. Listen, I'm a woman, like I said, and uh, I know these signs, and they are all leading to the same direction, so. In my mind, I'm just like, is she pregnant or not? Mm. I think she might be pregnant. Pregnant? Girl, you wild. Why, why? Yeah, I've been doing a lot of bump and grinding it. I know, but I'm saying, like, I ain't never, like, shoot the club up. You sure? Because, like, if that, if that happens, like, what do we do? <laughs> I'm trying to think. I never did. I, there was never a time where I, I thought maybe I did an accident or nothing like that, no. This is too much already, like. So she is what we gonna do. Mm. Gonna keep it? I mean, well, I mean, I have no choice. I mean, that's her choice, really, right? But I don't think she's pregnant. I feel no. like, nah. I don't know. She got no reason. I'm gonna go check on her. I'm gonna ask her. All right. Damn. I hope she ain't pregnant though. So I go to the bathroom and I see Yans like flushing the toilet, like low key trying to hurry up and like cover up whatever's going on. But I'm a woman, y'all. I know I peep vibes, I peep energy, and I peep the little signs. And I'm just like, something ain't right right here. Brush the back of your tongue. You gotta get back there now. Yeah, but what? So okay, how, right. how long you been feeling like this? Um, like maybe maybe a couple weeks. A couple of weeks. I mean, and it, ain't, it ain't been it. too bad, you know. But why like, you it's never... manageable? So like, do you have like headaches? Yeah, but that's running my family. It so, is. yeah, my mom, my grandma, we all get migraines. Stuff like that, so. Have you been, like, tired a lot? Yeah, mm -hmm. kinda, cause you have been sleeping. I mean, girl, gotta get her sleep, right? Mm -hmm. oh. So I'm not feeling too well, and after I come out the bathroom, I'm just like, well, that was really weird. So I get to thinking, and really, I just think I've been drinking all week. You know, it's just been too much. I mean, I've been eating too much or not eating enough and, and drinking too much. So, you know, I, I really just, 
you know, it just goes up and down sometimes. That's all I'm thinking about. Come in here. So, okay, so I have a question. Mm -hmm. Do you think you might be pregnant? Pregnant? Mm. Cause you know what that feels like, right? Mm -hmm. Do you? I do, but I don't think it might be something else for real. Like I really can't even put my finger on it. So I ain't gonna say that just yet. I ain't, you know. But exactly, so I, you're not sure. <clears throat> so okay, what about your cycle? My cycle. Like how has it been late? It all? might have been a little late, but for the most part, it should come on. So how many days? What you mean, like a little late? Like what? like a week late? But you Bruh, know, it's, a week. But I'm cramping, so it's it's coming soon. That's what I'm saying. Like <laughs> you're cramping. No, yeah. this isn't funny. I'm being serious. So. Do you think that we should take it? I'm not trying to be funny either, but like, do you think, I think we should take a test. I'm not you do? Lie. You sure? I definitely think, uh, yeah. Cause I might not be feeling too good, but I mean, we can take it. Yeah, if, we got, I feel like we need to. I mean, all right, we can see what's up, but. All right. You know, I feel like um, I'll be, I'll be straight for real, but we'll see. Yes. We can do the test. Okay. All right. <laughs> I think we can just go to Walgreens. So princess, gives me the suggestion to take a pregnancy test. And I'm just like, what? Is it really that serious? I'm like, all right, because you know, we, we all together and you know, we all be, be together. So if anything, it's, it's good for everybody to know. So I'm, I'm down to take it just so we can know for sure. Everything good? Mm, I don't know. What's wrong? <sighs> Leia thinks that she's pregnant? Mm, damn. This would really like change everything we got going on right now. This is a fresh relationship. She just moved in. Like her being pregnant is gonna really throw shit off right now. So I don't know, we're about to find out. What you mean find out? You gonna take the doctor or something? She got a what stomach about? virus? Nah, I think um, we're just gonna go to Walgreens or CVS when I'm done with this so we can get a pregnancy test. Pregnancy test? Yeah. The girl is really... late on her period. She's, she's late in her period? Yeah, she's like a week late. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. why, why didn't she mention this before? Why don't we just find this out now? I'm suggesting that she needs to take a pregnancy test at this point because I need to know what's going on because it only affects him or her. It affects all of us as a whole. And so I'm telling Flo, like, look, babe, I think she actually might be or could be pregnant and we need to look into this further and figure out what we're going to do next. So pregnancy test, here we come. All right, y'all. So we are on our way to... Huh? Mm, just us vlogging. We about to take her to um Walgreens. Uh CVS real quick. So now we gotta go to the store, we gotta get a whole test, and we gotta see what the results are. So we go out and do that. <laughs> you never bought a pregnancy test? No. I probably buy like 20 other things too and just mix it in there. So, so would you be embarrassed? Like what? what? No, not really. <laughs> so how you feeling? Like, are you nervous? Cause are you nervous about taking this? Honestly, I, I think it would be good. So you saying you don't think you're pregnant? Cause I know if I was a week late and I'm throwing up and I'm like, then I, I automatically know, you know, mm -hmm. but yes, I don't always know. So, you know. I mean, everybody's, everybody's body is different. Every woman's body is different. I will say that, but you know, it's always good to just be on the safe side and know just in case. Cause I mean, obviously you wouldn't be the only one involved in this situation. Exactly. So. Yeah. 
but you know, we're, we're, we're about to find out. So hopefully the results aren't as anything. Yeah. So what do you, what would you want the results to be? Uh, negative. <laughs> so. I ready for all that right now. All of what? Being pregnant. Like, that's a lot. But you wouldn't be going through it by yourself. So we're in the car on the way to get the pregnancy test. And I'm like a little low key nervous. I'm not gonna lie. Cause even if I'm taking a pregnancy test, I'm nervous. So I'm definitely nervous for the next bitch. Well, not bitch, but you know. So like, what would you um, want to do with like, you know, the baby if. With the baby? Yeah, like what's your thoughts on like having the baby, keeping the baby? Like what, how do you feel about that whole thing? How would you feel about it? I mean, I'm listen, I am a hundred percent whatever you would want to do. Obviously, you know. Yeah, I mean, it's it's something that we I've thought about as a as a woman and just doing this kind of stuff, you know, the possibilities of it happening definitely crossed my mind. So I can't just sit up here and say, like, oh, I'd be mad. Like I couldn't do that. This is a whole baby we're talking about, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, it is a lot. I would just kind of be like, damn. But uh so I'm talking to her, I'm trying to get a feel of how she's feeling and like, you know, what she would want to do if this was a situation. I got to be real with y'all. Like, obviously, you know, I'm in this poly relationship and, you know, these are the kinds of things that are expected to happen. I'm not stupid. I know what I'm signing myself up for. So it's not like I'm just like, you know, so I'm just kind of already just accepting it like it is what it is. So I'm just trying to see what she's thinking. And she's like, okay, yeah, I mean, I want, if that's the case, I would want to keep it. I would want to go forward. And that's fine. I would never want any woman to feel like they need to get rid of their child. I would never even promote that. I don't even believe in that type of stuff. And, hey, your body, your choice, baby. But, you know, that's just, I would want, and I wouldn't want to, I don't want to want Flo to feel any type of way about that either. Because we've tried, obviously, y'all know we've tried a couple times and it didn't work. And so this is actually an exciting moment for him too. So I, I wouldn't want to take that away from either of them. So that's kind of where I'm at with it. Well, we're going to see. We're about to go to Wally's and get the Tay. Shot going to take that Tay. And then. And then. You're going to be near good Tay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to just say this. When I be pregnant, man, I be so freaking sick and just oh so miserable like oh i hate being pregnant see i wouldn't if i was like that all the time like how did you deal with it girl i didn't deal with it i felt like every day was like the worst day of my life <laughs> And I, I was just always so miserable and depressed. It's not a healthy thing because I have, I don't know if you ever heard of this thing. It's called um, hyperemesis, garbodarm or something like that. But it's very, very intense morning sickness. Like, you know what morning sickness is like. You, It's not really just in the morning. It's all freaking day. And I would throw up like eight to ten times a day, every day. And I was yeah, so, so, I would get so, so skinny. I can't eat nothing or nothing because it just comes right back up. That's why I hate being pregnant. So I'm like, why do we have to go through? I know. This is wild. You know, me and Leia have a little heart to heart. You know, asking questions about the situation. She, I'm asking her. You know, how she feels about it, and you know, she, she pretty much gives me, you know, some positive vibes about it. That she'll be supportive. But then too, you know, you never know. So once we find out what's really going on, there might be a different side to the story. Yeah, Walmart's is much cheaper. The dollar stores is a dollar. Okay. Uh, all right, little mama. About to go take the little tag. All right, y'all. So, um, we just got home. I'm going to have her take this test and look up. There's bugs everywhere. They flying. They trying to get in the house. We got to get in. Yeah. Open all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, you guys. Mm -hmm. oh, all right, y'all. So we about to take this test. When I tell y'all, like, my nerves are shot and I need a shot, boy. So let's get to it.
You ready for this? Are you ready? Mm -hmm, I guess so. Guess we need to see what's going on. Here we go. Uh, cheers. So now we're finally back home and took the test and everything. We're all waiting for the results. So we're taking the test, you know, I'm just kind of like letting her know it's okay, whatever it is, this is what it is. We finally come back with the results and the test says. What's that? Is that so we take the test and um, 